Larissa here and today we're going to be talking about your options when you want to buy a brand new home. One that's never been lived in by anyone else. It's going to be have that new home smell. Whatever that is, I'm not quite sure. To get yourself a new home, you have three choices. You can, number one, build yourself a custom home from scratch. Number two, get a semi-custom build. Or number three, buy a spec home. So what does this mean? Well, let's go over our choices. Deciding between the three options depends mostly upon your desire to control the process, what you actually need out of your home, and the amount of time and money that you have to give to the process. So let's go over our three different types of homes. Let's start off with the creme de la creme, the fully custom home. The word build a grade rarely is ever mentioned in the same sentence with a custom home. You have complete control over everything from the lot where the home is going to be built, the elevation, the floor plan, the materials used, the finishes, the look, the colors, you name it, it is your home. Usually you will work with your own very carefully chosen architect and builder to work with them on the building process step by step. Now, building a custom home is not for the faint of heart. They can take a lot longer to build and can be easily derailed by material shortages, labor shortages. In addition, custom homes can go off budget very easily, adding thousands, if not tens of thousands, to the cost of your build unless you're very, very careful. And because custom homes generally cost more to build, the final home may not actually appraise at the full value of what it actually costs you to build the home, so now you're going to be on the hook for the difference. So let's sum it up. The pros. You get a floor plan that is tailored to your needs and wants. You have complete control over every detail of the build. You will have a fully unique home. You can oversee each step of the process personally. The cons. Takes much more time to build. It can actually overwhelm you with the amount of decisions that you need to make. Are very costly and may not even appraise at the full value that it actually costs you to build. Let's take a look at semi-custom homes. Semi-custom homes are the sweet spot between a pre-built home and a fully custom home. Your home won't look exactly like every home on the street, but it won't be fully unique either. Semi-custom homes allow you to have some input into design choices, but at the same time, you will not have to make a decision about every little part of the build. When you know that a fully custom home is just not in the cards for you right now, a semi-custom build may just be the option that you're looking for. In semi-custom homes, the builder will give you an option of several floor plans to choose from, and then you will continue to go on and pick out finishes, cabinets, colors, etc. So you can make the home all your own without putting in too much effort. Once again, let's sum up the pros and cons. Pros. Building takes less time. The home costs less and is usually appraised at cost or sometimes even higher. You can sit back and let the professionals make most of the major decisions for you. Less chance of nasty surprises and delays still gives you enough choices to make the home feel like it is custom to you. Cons. You are limited in your options and your favorite design finishes may not be available. The floor plan has limited customization options, if any at all. You will not have any control or say at all during the building process. Now let's look at spec homes. Spec homes is what they used to call tract homes. A builder will purchase a set of lots and build them to spec or are what is considered popular options with home buyers at that time. So they're speculative options. You can buy a brand spanking new home, but you will have no say at all in the floor plan, designs, cabinetry, colors, finishes, etc. The good news is that spec homes are meant to be appealing to the general home buyer. So when you move into the home, it will be a very nice home to move into. In addition, because these homes are designed to sell, if it's not going to be your forever home, you know that you will be able to sell it very easily again in the future. So let's pro and con the spec homes. They are typically much more affordable than a custom or a semi-custom home. They are usually move-in ready, no waiting on the build, and no uncertainty on your move-in date. 
it is the easiest buying process with no major decisions to make just get your mortgage pre-approved and go you get to see the actual house before deciding to buy no uh, buying based on a floor plan and a hope and dream easy appeal easy to resell cons any customization that you would like are going to be done at your own cost after closing the finishes are going to be rather generic and non-offensive hello cookie cutter your house is going to look pretty similar to the other houses in the neighborhood although it's not as bad as it was in the past just like with a pre-existing home you have to make your offer fast and you might get in a bidding war with other buyers especially in today's market i hope that you too will get in a brand new build home whichever option you go with bye bye bye